Hello, Amazon.com. It's me, Bo Shevisu, coming to you today with this orange printer on the left. It's from Comer or Comir. I don't know how it's pronounced, but I'm comparing it side by side next to a best selling Rolo printer. I've used this thing forever to print stuff off on my 4x6. And look, we've got some stuff loaded in the back. And I'm gonna go through the installation, but first, let's actually print something side by side. So right now, we have this little unicorn thing, and we're gonna print it in three, two, one, go. Oh, oh that, oh, that was pretty. Okay, now, now let's print the same thing on the actual uh, Rolo printer. Okay, so I selected little orange. Now we're gonna do the. Amazon thermal printer and you do have to select four by six if in fact you have four by six in there We're not doing 20 copies. We're doing one copy and we're gonna scale and fill the entire page. Here we go three two one print Okay, 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 here we go. All right girls All right, let's put that one there and that one there and let's compare the quality side by side shall we so this is the Rolo This is the orange Homer printer, okay? Let's actually put this in the light, okay? So we're gonna take it over here and you're gonna see side by side if there are any remarkable differences at all. And I'm gonna be honest with you, they look pretty much the same. Well, let's, let's look at the dark hooves right there. See the black and then the black right there. That, that, is, that is pretty much the exact same. Okay, so you know what? I'm just gonna go with whatever's cheaper because they are operating the exact same. Matter of fact, I'm almost kind of partial to the uh, Comer printer because I'm gonna tell you why. See that little thing back here? This, uh, that tray that I put the stacks of four by six labels in? That did not come with the printer. However, Comer was thoughtful enough to actually include one in the package. So already, that saves you like 20 bucks. Oh, it looks like Penny kind of ripped that off. There we go, that's fine. So uh, uh, let me let me show you this here. I'm just gonna push this. All right, that was fast, and... Oh, I would say that this was slightly faster. This one kind of did a little hiccup at first to get it out. Interesting. Now, one last hint tip trick. I would suggest getting the fan fold like this. The, ro the rolling things like this, they're kind of annoying. So I'd recommend actually getting the fan fold. Uh, this does come with uh, a few little free things, uh, free labels for you, but obviously, um, you know, look at my other reviews. The, some of these labels do not work very well, and I've gone through about maybe four or five different brands, and some of them get jammed in here. They drive me crazy. Oh, in case you're wondering how this actually opens up, you have to open one on this side and one on this side, like that and then it pops up like that. Okay, so that's in case it gets jammed for some really weird reason. It's a great printer until it runs out of labels. Then it has the most obnoxious, annoying beep I've ever heard in my life. And it will not stop doing this until you put your labels back in, which I'm gonna try with these uh, uh, special labels, which I think is pretty cool that it does have the ability to actually, um, you know, uh, use the one and a half by three inch labels right there. But man, until you put it in, it will keep beeping. And uh, if they can please improve on the beeping, boy, that's obnoxious. Now, I, I'm, I'm probably not gonna take a star off of that simply because it does work as advertised, but just a small thing. So let's continue with the actual review. Here we go, let's close out of my little unicorn that I printed off for my girls. Now, when, when you download this from the website, Comer, kcomer.com, uh, uh, you'll find it right there. You can't actually Google for Comer. For some reason, I couldn't find them anywhere. But this is the easiest way to download on a Mac. Download the zip right there. It'll download the zip file down here in your downloads. However, when you unpack it and when you go to actually try to open it, Check this out. You'll probably get this right there. Um, so you're going to double click on that and you're gonna open it up. And that is the installation package right there. And you're gonna right click on that. And if you were to click installer, then it should give you the ability to open it up. So just try right clicking or a combination of hitting 
control or option or command when you click on it because for some reason the software is not verified by Apple. They're a little protective when it comes to these weird third-party softwares. But once you're able to install it, super easy. All you need to do is then you go into search and I search for printers and scanners like that. And then I just click the little plus sign right there. And then I selected RX106F and then I named it whatever I liked. I called it little orange and then you click add. And that is pretty much it. Then it immediately shows up. And then when you go to actually open up anything, whether it's a label for um, printing or something, all you do is hit Command P. And uh, oh, look at that. It remembered that it was four by six. That is pretty cool. And then you click print and then out it comes as you saw at the very beginning of this video. So I'm gonna put the link in the description of this video below. So in case you are curious about other people's reviews, you are welcome to take a look at them. That's it, my name is Bo Chevazu. Hopefully this down and dirty demonstration of this little guy works for you. So far, compared side by side, if it's cheaper than Rolo on Amazon, I would recommend getting this guy. It works just as well, the quality is just as good, and it comes with some little pickles fun little bonuses that, uh, you know, will ultimately save you money in the long run. That's it.